morning guys, you two people, world, everywhere, wherever. Oh, anyway, back at it, half fast, 719. Um, yeah, I'm tired. I got home at uh, about midnight last night. <clears throat> um, oh nice, the wife bought some wood glue. Awesome. Didn't see that. Thank you. What else did you buy me? Oh, that's old stuff. So I can finally, uh, she bought me some wood glue so now I can finish my makeshift butcher block pine bench top, I guess you can call it. Anyway, <clears throat> got home last night, like I said, from working up there in, uh, Altores, California, Altores, however you want to call it, um, Susanville, whatever, um, wore out, wore out the heck, doing some laundry today, got all my work clothes, usually I only wear about, go through about four sets of work clothes, because, uh, um, they don't really get that dirty, but this time, man, I just got dirty. Dirty every day. Sweating my butt off. Dirty every day. Dirt every day. Joe Dirte. Or, uh, anyway. So I got some packages last night, or yesterday, or the day before. I don't know when I got them, but I got this uh, rebuild kit for Project Crack Pipe Walker Productions. Or Walker Walker products, not productions, because I'm thinking of movies. <clears throat> so I'll be taking that uh, throttle body apart and doing a rebuild, a little overhaul. So you see, the main part I think I need is that accelerator pump, um, diaphragm, whatever you want to call it. And uh, some miscellaneous stuff, seals and stuff. I think I got a lot of uh, leak by, which is why the truck is hard to start. Um, today I should be getting some headers. Um, Friday I think I get some shocks. So I ordered some shocks, some just some Monroe yellow shocks. Um, probably paint them black. Or uh, something, or maybe I'll just leave them. I'll probably just leave them the jello color. Um, I got this Y pipe, <clears throat> this little pipe here, because I think I'm gonna have to do my own uh, exhaust. Because I ordered some headers, headers should be here today, like I said, and uh. I'm not too sure if they're a direct bolt-on for the project crack pipe. Look at that beast. All slammed and lowered. Um, but yeah, so I might have to do my own pipe. Um, what I'll do is, you got the one header that's going to come off here. I'll have to get some 45s, some 90s and bend it here and then the other one kind of a straight shot kind of be like a 45 a 90 here um, and then I have to straight pipe the uh, I might actually already have the pipe I might just need some straight pipe straight pipe straight pipe for crack crack pipe um, anyway <clears throat> yeah so this is gonna go. I'll probably have to cut it something like in here and then bring this up like this. But we'll see. And then I think the other, and I might actually already have pipe. That might be kind of cool, fool. Uh, and then this one. I mean, obviously, I'll probably have to add some pipe in here, maybe. 
and then add some pipe in here but uh, yeah I might actually might actually already have a pipe for it that's cool and then uh, yeah I'll straight pipe it so it's gonna lie from here to there from that side back and then I'll uh, I'll have to delete the catalytic converter that's in there and then I'll just run it into the muffler the muffler maybe I'll see if I can get a different muffler but this project's a project it's uh basically use what I got reuse what I can um spend as little as I can on this project and uh yeah, so I'll probably reuse a bunch of stuff. So anyway, like I said, I might already have the pipe for this. I do have a little, a little, little piece of pipe. Um, anyway, sorry guys, I ain't got no energy. I'm beat, wore out. I think all I'm really going to do today is I'm just going to do some laundry. And... Uh, some laundry and I'm gonna move the Audi that thing's filthy pig man it was so dirty and dusty up there wind was blowing and where I was working and where I park it's uh, just a big dust hole anyway move the Audi pull the truck in here and uh, if I have more energy later today tonight I'm gonna start tearing the front end apart Taking the fenders, hood, everything off. And, uh, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to start. I don't know if I'm going to pull the cab off. I don't know if I'm going to pull the suspension apart. Because that box that's down there, the cardboard box, is all the suspension crap. Oh, boy. Let me grab it. This has all the ball joints and junk, all new ball joints, sway bar in links, uh, idler arm coupler things, or uh, inner outer tie rods, ball joint, um, outer tie rod, coupler, outer tie rod, pitman arm. And this, oh, maybe that's the pit line. I don't, I don't know what that is. This is the pitman arm. That's the pitman arm. I don't know what that is. Maybe I got the wrong kit. Um. Tie rod in, tie rod in, tie rod in, tie rod in. That's weird. That's the Pitman arm because it's got teeth. That, that. Ball joint, ball joint, ball joint. The heck is this crap? Um. Maybe that's a uh, idler arm. I don't know. Fuck that year ago or something, I don't remember. Too tired. Oh, okay, it's right. It's right. It goes right there. That's the one. That's the main one that's blown out. It's that whole that whole arm. It's right. Okay. Let's see this thing holding. Oh dude, it's so nasty in there. Look at that crap. This is why you don't run water, people. You don't run water in iron blocks. So I have to flush it out again. Anyway, I'll flush it out later. But right now I'm just going to move the Audi, pull the truck in the G-Rodge, and uh, yeah, then go in and relax. So I'll be right back. I'll be back. You'll see the truck pull in.
got the beast project crack pipe in the garage. Get your saw pulling in. I do have the fan hardwired right now because I don't know. I got work to do. Um, anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Move the Audi back. Pull the wife's car back up towards the garage. And uh, we'll go inside, like I said, and relax for a little bit. Alright guys, make sure you guys subscribe. Comment. I'll make sure to show you guys the uh, headers. Um, it'll probably be tomorrow's video headers will be on tomorrow's video and uh, like I said my plan is to pull the hood pull the whole front end off um, so yeah I might actually have to pull the truck back out and drain the radiator maybe maybe not maybe I'll just leave it dangling in there so alright guys thanks for watching subscribe Comment. Let me know what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see something different. Got any ideas, any plans. But that's going to be it. Make sure you guys subscribe. Follow. Comment. Give me a like. Help the channel out. Thanks for watching. Later guys.